gonna do it up real big, boy. Hello, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Jurassic World. We've got this countdown to no power outages. We need a Velociraptor with reaction speed modification. I remember I set up my Velociraptor um, cages over here, right near the beginning of the tram. So right when somebody gets off the tram, they can get fucking mauled by a Velociraptor. Um, but the thing that I probably need to do is go back to the other island so I can get some more goodies to sell goodies from the expedition center bring them back over to this fossil center and sell them which is the way to go if you're looking to make money on a brand new island so i'm gonna do that and i think also we get isla nublar if i get this island to four stars from what i understand so hopefully we can do that shouldn't be that hard honestly We've got a, a good amount of dinosaurs. We need to keep these meat eaters separate, is what I learned. I've got fucking two Ceratosauruses and one Velociraptor in this park, and that <laughs> that poor Velociraptor, he's just fucking frightened all the time. Probably gonna end up starving because the Ceratosauruses are uh, conquering the food. You know what I mean? So like I said, I don't really know if they team up if the uh, Ceratosauruses will figure out that they outnumber the raptor and attack him or something like that. Hopefully not, because everybody loves a Velociraptor. When I initially started this game, I said, hey, I'm not going to do any Velociraptors or carnivores, but I'm super glad that we did. That was pretty sweet. Um, so let's go Expedition Center. What do we need? What do we need here, Velociraptors? Yes, they're all over. Dinosaur's been successfully raised to maturity and is ready to be released. I'm going to go hunting for Dilophosauruses. And there's another Velociraptor ready to go. Hooray, so this little Velociraptor can have a friend. He's still not going to beat the, the Ceratosauruses, though. Two little dinosaurs versus two fucking giant dinosaurs. Oh my god, it's so cool. Really great job on that contract. Hey, thanks. That's what I do, though. Look at him. Fucking amazing, isn't he? And he's so healthy. And slightly uncomfortable. Oh, did you hear that? They announced that the Velociraptor arrived. That's pretty sweet. So, the social meter's in the blue now. We probably don't want to have too many Velociraptors in this cage. I think maybe three. Oh shit! They're fighting! Oh my god. Are you really? Are you really gonna do that, bro? Holy shit. Panicking. Yeah, you don't stand a chance. Not until you get some, uh, some buddies together. Some of your buddies! Uh, photograph a dinosaur eating from a feeder. That's probably what we need to do now. So, where's my ranger teams? We can get one of them up here. Add a task to resupply this, and then I'll, uh... I'll hopefully catch somebody eating. That would be quite nice. Although I do just enjoy cruising around in the van as well. Dang. They're fucking fighting. Oh no. They're friends, right? Are you guys friends? I don't think they're friends. Look at those water effects. Got water dripping off the dinosaurs. That is fucking nice. Panicking Ceratosaurus is like, I wanna fight. Velociraptor's like, no fucking way. That ain't gonna happen. Alright, ranger team's here. Hey, friends. I'm gonna... S to see if I can, uh... Get a picture. Get a picture of somebody eating. Would that be okay? Holy shit. Velociraptor knocking me around. Super! Somebody gonna come eat this goat? I just need to keep an eye on the goat, I guess. Hey, 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 hey! Whoa! Back it the fuck up! Jesus. Oh my. Oh my! Where's the goat? And then the leg drops onto the car. It's just like, uh, the Jurassic Park! You know what I'm saying, uh, T-Rex? We should get a T-Rex. <laughs> we have a T-Rex! Oh, here he comes. Look at this boy. He gonna do it. Yum! 
<laughs> Ceratosaurus eating live food. Yeah. Super. That is a textbook example of doing it right. Oh, we need it from eating from a feeder. All right, somebody eat from the feeder. The oh god, I don't like this place. <laughs> They're fucking clipping through each other. What are you guys doing? Somebody come eat from the feeder. Come on, y'all. Good boy, good boy. Oh my. Everybody having a good time? Is that Velociraptor gonna eat? I <laughs> this is fucking just chaos. I don't know what's going on. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get on over. Uh, incubate, hatch, and release three new dinosaurs. New, like, new creatures, species I've already made before? I guess that's good. It'll help get my stars up. I'm gonna make another Velociraptor. That's what I'm gonna do. Hell yeah. Look at this. 84%. Good boy. You're a good boy. And then I could probably make a couple of, uh... A couple of veggie sores, if that would please. Hmm. Triceratops. That's a good one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I think I'll do a Struthi and a Triceratops. Sounds good to me. Should incubate relatively quick. The Struthiomimesis just goes so fast. That's awesome. Oh, and we've also got the uh, people back from the Expedition Center. So yeah, uh, go get some more Dilophosaurus. I got so much money over here, I don't even know what to do with it. That's pretty sweet. Alright, what you got for me? Oh, we could sell this Rhodium. A little bit Dilophosaurus. Go ahead and extract these. Very well. And I'll save the Rhodium for when we get back to the, uh, the other island. So we can make a little bit of money. But hopefully I can get a little bit more, uh, like maybe two or three things to sell. And then we'll go back to the other island, cash that shit in. Uh, that's gonna be good. Alright, here you go. Struthiomimus, you're, you're free. Enjoy. They still seem to be comfortable, so that's good. But yeah, I'm gonna need to make another cage, because these fucking velociraptors are not having a good time. Um... So where should I make the cage? There is the question. Put it right near the hotel? Is that a smart idea? <laughs> uh, maybe not. Well, let's see what we got here. Creation lab. Actually, I could build this after I built the cage. Let's stick a road in here. We could bring it back. Da -dum -da -dum. Like so. And we need enclosure. Hmm. Fence would be a good thing to have. Of course. What is this? Oh, electrified fence. That's why it's showing me. Hey, you want a fence, right? Yeah, kinda, I guess. I don't know shit. Gotta build the, the fence first. Okay. So there's no power here. Probably need to get some power over here. But it'll wait. It'll wait. Everything's fine. And we'll just build it around the hotel. Isn't that going to be fun, you guys? Are you, you going to have a good time here, over here? Yeah, of course you are. I hope I don't run out of room or something like that. And um, build it back down. Shazoom. And that's it. Complete. Now we need a creation lab, if I remember correctly. This is also going to need power. But I'm going to build power to like all of this stuff, so I guess it's fine. Oh, dead dinosaur. Got a dead dinosaur on our hands. And a gate. Yes. We need a gate so people can get in, people can get out, everybody's going to be happy. All right. Now, substations. Yes. 
We need a substation indeed. So, how about right here? Where's the fucking power line? Okay. There we go. And how can I build a lot of these in, like, quick succession? I need much, much more, uh... Much more... What do you call it? What am I trying to say? Much more fucking shit or whatever. <laughs> there you go. That's what I'm trying to say. Alright. Build this over here. Is this all hooked up or... Are we running out of power? We are. We're gonna need another power station. Oh boy! There's two dead dinosaurs. I need to get these the fuck out. Oh, Triceratops, no! That's so sad. Well, <clears throat> ACU Center, get on over here. I'm not sure if I remember how to do this. Let's see, transport team, there we go. Heading to pick up the asset. Remove one, remove two. There you go. Can they grab both of them at the same time? That would be just awesome. We're out of power here. Oh, where am I going to build another fucking power station? Um, let's get a substation over here, I suppose. Shazam. So is that all connected, or, or, or what's going on? No. Requires power. Ah! We're out of power. How could this happen to me? Alright. Well, how about... Asset being how's a bounty? Could it fit over here? I guess not. It's like dipping into the water. Ah, crap. Obstructed. Terrain constraints. Obstructed. Dude, I'm just trying to I'm just trying to do it right. Don't you want me to do it right? There we go. Like this. Oh god. This is an exact science. Alright. We got it. Shazam, hook it up. We'll get the road coming in here. That's gonna be good. It's good. It's good. And then like down, around. Can I do it like this? Oh god. It's running into the building. I didn't leave enough room for the road. We're gonna have to build it like way around. I'm not gonna like that at all. Alright, make it like this. And then can it fit here? Could could we fit it? No. It's not gonna fit. <laughs> Shit, man. Well this is the first time I run into this problem at least. Hmm. How could I just move something? Move something ever so slightly. Alright, build this back. How about that? Nope, that's not working. Piss! Piss and balls. Well, we might have to literally build it all the way around this fucking enclosure. I really don't like that. I don't understand why it doesn't generate power. Why do you need a fucking road to, to connect to the building in order for it to generate power? How much sense does that make, huh? None sense. That's how much. Alright, building it around. Roundy round. Who's, who's going to want to go to the fucking power station anyways? Nobody. That's why it's sort of ridiculous. But okay, we're gonna play it your way. We'll play it your way. That's fine. Maha. Here we go. Obstructed. Come on, come on. It's there. It's there, you just have to do it. All right. Well, that is far more complicated than I was hoping. Oh boy. Now what's this other error? My god. I don't know what that error means. Somebody, somebody tell me. 
Well, we're having a good profit per minute, something like that. Oh, is that a dead dinosaur? One that couldn't incubate? Maybe not. The Velociraptor's good to go. Oh, wait, shit, beauty. Look at that. And so smart, too. Yay. She's calling out for her buddies. She's like, hey, where do I belong? We see those two really fucking huge dinosaurs. Just stay away from them. See, the health of the Velociraptors is going down because um, they're getting fucked up. They're getting fucked up by the Ceratosauruses. So, come over and heal this guy. I'm going to get them moved as soon as possible. That's why I built a new enclosure. We just got so much stuff going on, I tell you that. Where am I missing power? Hmm. This needs a road connection. Why? Why does everything need a road connection? Hmm. Not this quite sure. This opportunity is solid and can really help the entertainment division. So please consider it. A 60% baryonyx genome. I don't even know where to where to start with that. Not entirely sure what a genome is, but if it's new, I like it. So, is it new? Yes. Ah, oh, it's new. It's yeah. Good. Let's get rid of some trees here. Just erase all of this wildlife. Yes. And I'll leave some, you know. Dinosaurs lack trees. But these are fucking velociraptors, so they don't need too many trees. And then add a little bit of water. Look at that there. That's so nice. Looking pretty good. Alright. Hammond Creation Lab needs a road connection. So let's see what we can do about that. One, two, obstructed. Why obstructed? Oh god. We've got another sick dinosaur over here. Dead dinosaur. Fuck. How does this keep happening? It's the uh, Struthiomimus. Poor little Struthi. What have we got to get him out of here? To collect the asset. En route. I didn't watch those two dinosaurs when they left. Did they collect both of those dinosaurs together? I bet they didn't. Because they're fucking dinosaurs. Okay. This velociraptor is looking a little sick. Hey, buddy. I'm sorry you're dehydrated. Yeah, he's lacking food and water because the ceratosauruses are, are fucking with him. So let's see if we can get somebody over there to heal him right quick. And then, uh, yeah, we can we can get these guys moved. Oh, it's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be good. Maybe we don't need the creation lab over here. How about that? How about I just fucking destroy this? Yes. And then I can just move move the raptors. I think that's the way to go. Transport. Move or sell. Um, I'd like to move, if you don't mind. Hmm. Add task. Transport or sell unconscious dinosaurs. Oh, so you gotta trank them first. That's why. That's how they get you. Alright. ACU helicopter. Trank these fucking dinosaurs. Maybe it'll be easier to move the Ceratosauruses. Alright. You guys gotta go. Setting additional task. Fucking assholes. <laughs> they're such assholes! I don't understand why they're such assholes! Yes, I do. Because they're meaty Sauruses! Oh, we also got tri Triceratops here. Watching you Hooray! Work. Now that's what I call entertainment. Watching me work. Everybody gotta work, 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 because we got some dinosaur. Sorry, sorry. Oh, she's a beauty, isn't she? Yeah. I'm so glad the herbivores can just all get along. 
That's so nice. Look, he's so happy to be alive. Also kind of fucking stomped out that, <laughs> that Struchiomimus, but I guess that's okay. Population and social are both looking good for Triceratopses. Excellent. So we just need to worry about these Ceratosauruses. Tranquilized. Yeah! Look at you now, you big sleepy bitch! Um, Ranger team, I need you to come over here and take a picture of this. No problem. No problem. And transport team, I need you to move select destination here. And another one here. Excellent! Good job, everybody! We gotta move those dinosaurs because they're uh, not letting the Velociraptors drink. The Velociraptors are about to die because Ceratosaurus is just an asshole. I don't understand why he's such an asshole. Couldn't you guys just be friends? There's enough meat to go around. I keep the food relatively well stocked and stuff. Dango. We're still bouncing around. We're not quite four stars yet, which makes me sad. Asset has been collected. Oh crap! And now the Velociraptors are done eating. That's the whole reason I sent the Ranger team over here. Fart. Fart and a half. All right, let me drive this vehicle. Hey, Velociraptors! You having a good old time? Let me get this dart rifle. I'm gonna heal ya. I'm gonna heal the fuck out of you. Stay still. Boosting health. Max health, health boost. Alright, cool. Then we just need to uh, take a little picture. Turn around real slow. What is this meat? Is this a cow? Somebody shave the cow before we, uh, before we put it in the feeder. It kind of looks like human meat, doesn't it? God, these Velociraptors are so angry. I am your master! I take good care of you! Somebody want to eat from the feeder? I guess not. Oh, they're all talking! You guys are so adorable! Yay! Look at them! Velociraptor socializing times three. Hell yeah! Give me my reward. Good work. Too bad I can't transfer that reward over to the other island where I actually need money. But oh well. Speaking of other islands, yeah, you go ahead and go home. I gotta head back to the, the fossil center. See what we got here. Or the expedition center, whatever. I don't really care. Just, just do something. We gotta do something. We gotta do something. Somebody do something. Osmium. All right. Looking pretty good. So we collect a little bit extra every time we, we bring these dudes back. And I'm actually going to hit that research center up. Expand the, uh, the available space for that shit. Oh, and transport. What is this? Monorail. High capacity carriages... Propelled around a guided rail, offering comfort, safety, and gorgeous views. Bulletproof layers provide an extra layer of security in the unlikely event of an emergency. So is it like, we already have the tram, and this is just like a better version of the tram? I don't, I don't, I don't quite understand. Dilophosaurus genome is now available as well. Um, first I want the extra storage space on the fossil center. That's what I want! Yes, indeed! We've got so much money. Should I build another hotel? Hmm. How can you ever have enough hotels? How can you ever have uh, too much money, you know? We gotta make some more money. Make it right now. Yeah. You guys wanna live near the, uh, the Velociraptors, do ya? Sounds like a really good idea. <laughs> that's, the, that's the space I wanna stay in, too. Right near the Velociraptor cages. Because they are smart enough to open doors. So they can uh, come up to your room. 
You can have a party. And after the party is the after party. And after the after party is... It's uh, something else. I don't know. I've never, I've never gone that far. Resupply, resupply some feeders. Task slots full. That's fine. Somebody's gonna eat from these fucking feeders eventually. I'm gonna catch somebody. And then you know what's gonna happen? Nothing. <laughs> I'll complete this stupid quest, which I don't really even need. Because our profit per minute is due through the roof. 309 profit per minute. Check that shit out. Ticket sales through the roof. Attraction revenue. Visitor center profits. Hmm. Visitor center. That's that big cone thing? Is it? Dilophosaurus. Go ahead and extract some more. I should just, uh, yeah. Keep exploring. And then if they find some really good Dilophosaurus DNA, then I'll be like, hey, check this shit out. And uh, sell it on the other island. And then that's also some more money that can be made. Look at these two hotels right across from each other. My goodness. Maybe we need some more food and gift shops and, well, probably emergency shelter. That's not a bad idea either. Just in case. Disease? Disease contracted. Also dead dinosaur. Fuck, man. Why you gotta do this? Is this... Is this Ceratosaurus trying to do something? He's testing the fences. He's not as dumb as he looks. But right now I got bigger problems. I got a sick dinosaur over here. Ranger team, do not return to base. We need your medication skills. And that other Hoyangosaurus is now dead, so... Shit. Heading to collect the acid. All the dinosaurs are dying! <laughs> uh, uh. Wait, let me drive the vehicle. Let me drive the vehicle. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. He's feeding. We take the picture. Shazam. Alright, Edmontosaurus I'm eating from a feeder. Got it. Of, and I'm not sure I wanna know. This fucking dude talks shit about my photo you skills. Let your foot off the gas until that contract crossed the finish line. That's true. That's why I make the big bucks. Kinda, I guess. I mean three hundred thousand per minute, that's that's pretty big bucks, but we also got a lot of upkeep costs, you know, we gotta pay employees, stuff like this. Oh my god, I really wish the sensitivity was higher for, for turning this mouse around, but I guess it'll work. Yeah! Confirming hit. Administering medication. Are we good? Yay! No sources of disease remain in the park. That's why I'm the best. That is why I am the best. Alright, what you got for me, fossil, fossil man? I want some good stuff! Hey, silver, that is some good stuff. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, give me more Dilophosaurus DNA. Gonna send that expedition out again. We should probably get the Huyangosaurus. I suggest you consider taking this contract. No. <laughs> Take pictures of dinosaurs fighting. No. We don't fucking play that around here, okay? Thank you very much, but I'm not abusing my creatures for your entertainment or or profit or or whatever the hell you do okay write it down hmm acu reload speed increase reload speed of tranquilizer darts pass increase accuracy allows one additional task to be assigned to acu teams okay yeah that's probably what i want and why would you not do all of your research and fucking everything on this I island? My god, pardon me. Because this is where I got all my money, see? I got so much invested here. And this is a really big fucking cage for the uh, Velociraptors. This is more land than they could possibly need. Oh god, I forgot to build um, meat. Meat feeder. Carnivore feeder. That's what it is. 
Sorry, guys. I'm not a very good, uh, captain. <laughs> I also probably need a viewing gallery, yes. Hmm. Where would that be? Enclosure? Yep, sure enough. Fart. I need it to be connected to the road, or, or what's going on? There we go, flip it. Flip it and dip it. Cool! Hey everybody, that's pretty cool! Alright, that's all connected up. Why am I still at fucking no stars? I'm just swapping back and forth. Flipping and flopping, swipping and swapping. Substation, this requires power. How did that happen? Crap. Um, okay. We'll make a pylon. There we go. And just, uh, snap it in like so. Oh, I guess not. There we go. You feeling good? You feeling better about that? Me too. That's great. Super job, everyone. We should probably make these cages a little smaller. Like, the herbivore cage is really, really huge, and I think that's what they need, because there's a lot of them all packed together. Chunkingosaurus. Huyangosaurus. Yeah, extract this DNA. And we've got some more osmium, silver. We can go back to the other island, I think. That'll be fine. We spent most of this episode on this island trying to get that, that four stars to unlock Isla Nublar. Requires four stars on Isla Matanceros. So we are so close to that, but we keep bumping up and down. That's a bummer. Isla Pena? Isla Muerta. So next one we'll unlock will be this Isla Tecano, and then Isla Pena, and Isla Sorna. So Isla Sorna, I guess, is the new, the new Jurassic Park, because all of these previous movies, most recent movies, have taken place on Isla Sorna. Um, so I really would like to go to Isla Nublar, because that's the Jurassic Park that, that I love. That's the original Jurassic Park. It would be quite nice to revisit it, but maybe we can't. I don't know what's happening. DNA screening increases dinosaur viability by 20%. Yes. Do that. And... Where was I gonna go? Yeah. We're done checking out those, those islands. I'm gonna head over to Isla Muerta. And maybe we can get some upgrading done here. It's slow, it's steady, but yeah, I just really love a dinosaur park. It is so fun to run a park full of dinosaurs. I don't know if you guys have done it before, but you should really give it a shot. Even if it's Dino Park Tycoon for MS-DOS, which is another series that I made, which I'm sure I mentioned. But go check it out, because it's super good. <laughs> and this is pretty good too. This is pretty good. Where's that fossil center? Now I'm all fucking mixed up. <laughs> Here we go. Fossil center. Now we'll make all this money. Sell it, sell it, sell it. Oh yeah. That's nice. Ah, feels good. Feels good, man. Now we've got so many fucking Struthiomimuses in this little herbivore cage. I want to get some, some what you call them, some big boys. You know, the big boys. I'm going to get them over here. Um, seems I can't build over here. Obstructed, obstructed, obstructed. Well, I seem to have fucked this up pretty royally, huh? Yep, I can't, I can't seem to build it anywhere. Should I get rid of that road? Is that my problem? Bam, bam, bam. How's that? Oh no, path not connected, no power. That's, that's fucking tragic. I saw it turn blue. You turn blue, you beautiful bastard. Come on. There it is. Oh god, it's such an exact science. 
Come on. You got it. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Criminy. And let's build this road back now. Super job, everyone. Can I demolish this little bit all by itself? I guess I can't. That's fine. It's a dead end. Deal with it. And this is all powered up and everything. We can connect this to there. So it's not wasted. Huzzah! Oh god. The storm is coming. Structure damaged. Substation 1 damaged. This is gonna be so bad. Holy crap. Once we actually have, like, carnivorous dinosaurs in those cages, if structures are getting damaged, power goes out, it's it's just not gonna be pretty. Alright, repair this substation. Go to substation 4. We need more repairs. Another building damaged. We got a lot of ranger teams, so it's not really that much of a problem. We just keep it going. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going full steam. But it is eating my money. Oh, god damn it. I worked so hard to get that money. Ah, uh, Slow going. Slow going on this island. I think I should just go back and try and get Isla Nublar together. That would be the way to go. So everything all repaired up, or, or how's that going? Hmm. We need repair here. Yeah. It's coming. Don't you worry. And I will lose more money. That's a bummer. But apparently we didn't have any it's power outages world. during that. This place so hell yeah. Makes it more dangerous. This contract Use an can ACU help us transport to sell at least one Huangyosaurus specimen. How much does it cost to make a Huangyosaurus? More than I got. Fuck that. Make something just to sell it? That's ridiculous. I want to do that. Yeah, two hundred seventy thousand. Bitch, please. Get your shit out of here. Ain't nobody got time for that. Alright, so, Velociraptor with reaction speed modification. We're not gonna have enough to make a Velociraptor. Even a basic ass... A basic bitch Velociraptor! We can't even do that. Right now we have null genes all across the board. I don't null gene, null gene. To say thank you. But in your case, I'll make an exception. Hey! You're welcome. Here's a reward for you. It's for your exceptional work on Isla Muerta. Oh, we got a expanded hatchery now. So we could hatch more more dudes at the same time. Unfortunately, I fucking <laughs> I don't have any money. Um so if we apply this gene, then the Velociraptor is still expensive as shit. I shouldn't be over here. I don't even know what's going on. I guess the money's going up. How much are we making per minute over here? 23,000. Fuck, we're making 10 times more on the other island. This is just ridiculous. Absolutely ridic. But at least everything's kind of put together here. At least a little bit. I should probably request a, a contract see how that will go. Designer jeans. Yeah. Give me a uh, science contract there. Research complete. Hey, that's super. Hey, that's super. Let's get a science I contract. Busy, but this opportunity is just too good to pass up. Storm defense station coverage on this island to 60%. Okay. How do I how do I know? where I'm covered. Hmm. Like a uh, manager view. There we go. Gift shop, substation. I don't think we even have... I think I sold my, my storm... storm coverage station, didn't I? 
Well, that was a really smart idea. Super job. I'm a little disappointed. We got seven Struthiomimuses and jack shit else. I'm so disappointed. Ah, where's that storm defense station? Provides protection against weather damage to nearby buildings. All right, well, let's get it here first. 60%. Gotta be crazy. You gotta be fucking crazy. How am I supposed to do this? Let's see how much that gives me. I wonder if they're talking about like the whole island or what I have built so far. Because what I have built so far might be easy. We could just build one there, another one there, and shazam. Shazam! But I guess we'll have to see. And power consumption. Yeah, we need to watch the fucking power. I have to hey! It. You delivered on that weather contract. I won't forget how you helped the science division. Doesn't mean I'm promising Easy. anything either. Doesn't mean I'm promising anything. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna ask for, don't you? Alright, so that was uh, like the easiest quest ever. Hey, build a station over there. Okay, cool. Okay, we got it. No worries. Chill out. Oh, good god. This, this island is just coming along so slowly. It is devastatingly slow. Let's see if we can incubate anything else. We could get a Triceratops going over here. Hey, hey! Should I do it? Should I? Ah, I'm gonna do it. There you go. If it dies in incubation, then I'm just going to, to flip my shit. It's gonna be over. I'm gonna kill all the dinosaurs. I'll throw them all in the ocean. I'll explode the volcano and... <clears throat> The Brontosaurus will be on the pier. Y you guys see that? That new Jurassic Park movie? Y'all seen that? That's sad. That was sad. I can't I can't throw all these Struthiomimuses in the ocean. I could eat them, though. <laughs> it's a little bit dry. Alligator meat. You know, you gotta mix it with chicken. Keep it wet. So, uh, so, uh, I guess we're just waiting for that fucking Triceratops. I could send another expedition out, but I'm scared that I won't get my money back. That's the worst. I guess we'll do it. I guess we'll do it. If I'm gonna be broke, I wanna be really fucking broke. You know what I mean? <laughs> just, just embrace your fate. Like, you know what? I don't have ten million dollars on this island. I might as well not even have ten dollars on this island. I just want it to be fucking over for me. Um, let's see how our profit margin is. Hmm, we're not wasting electricity now. That's a good thing. Attraction revenue, visitor center profits. I think visitor center is a really good thing to have, but we can't afford that. Pay attention to your expenses as these will be deducted from your income. No shit! <laughs> Hey, Triceratops is ready. Hey, go, boy! Hopefully, people are going to be excited for the one Triceratops surrounded by seven Struthiomimuses. Oh, there's like a little unlock thing in the upper right. I don't really know what it means! What does it mean? Boy, she's a beauty, isn't she? Look at that. Population, I think, has more to do with, like, the size of their cage, because this is a really small cage. So you need to balance social versus population. That's my theory, anyways. I don't really know if that holds water or what. But did that, uh, jack up my, my profit? Yeah, it did, boy! 41,000 per minute? Hmm. It basically doubled it. I'm going to need to make another one of those fucking Triceratopses. I'll tell you right now. Then we can get three stars. Super easy. Shazam. But it seems like there are also uh, diminishing returns. You know what I mean? The first hotel you build, they're like, cool, here's a star. And then you build a second hotel and they're like, cool, here's a quarter of a star. And then you build a third hotel and they're like, mm, here's a tenth of a star. And it, it gets really difficult. You gotta make your park fucking huge. But once your park gets all fucking huge, stuff starts to fall apart. You know what I mean? 
Like, we had 20 dead dinosaurs over at my other park. You remember? I remember. I've received Let's request a new contract. Definitely help the science division. And can help Maintain a total well. guest count of at least 700 for two continuous minutes. Are there 700 here now? I don't, I don't think so. The timer's not going down. We need more guests. Look at this fucking giant hotel. We don't even have 700 guests in there? Pathetic. That's pathetic. Um, so we could basically finance that expedition by selling this Dilophosaurus Amber. But I ain't gonna do that. I'm gonna extract that bitch. Yeah! I already, I already wasted some money. Why not waste some more? Go ahead. Go on ahead! Because the better the Dilophosaurus is, the uh, the more it's going to be worth in the end. At least for like the star meter or whatever. 409,000 to hatch one though? God damn. Those meat eaters are just so expensive. What's up with that? Alright. Get back out there. You think I'm done? A hundred and five... Yeah, fuck it. Just just keep keep going. I don't even care. <laughs> How do I see my guest count? Is that is that shown somewhere around here? Hmm. Well... Island navigation, expedition map, fossils that I got, research that I got, engine database... I assume it's in this first tab somewhere, right? Where are my guests? Finance breakdown. Hmm. Maybe we should be looking at ticket sales. Dinosaur sales. Ah, shit. Where is it? Where the fuck is that? Expedition find sales. Hmm. Well, it ain't it ain't showing me what I want. Come on, bro! Ticket sales. Uh, 84,000, basically. What does that mean? What does it all mean, Basil? I don't even know. I guess we're gonna have to wait. We'll get our guest count up eventually. I kinda wanna abandon this fucking... <laughs> Velociraptor with reaction speed modification. Like, who gives a shit, really? You know what I mean? I decided I was going to put Velociraptors here, but guess what? Now I want Dilophosaurus here. That would be much better. <laughs> I love Dilophosaurus. He a good boy. I think. I just haven't seen one yet, so so it makes me kind of excited. But yeah, we're, we're so low on funds over here. My god. I should just go back to the other island, work on getting four stars there. Ah, such frustration. Such frustration. Arrival point. This doesn't tell me how many people are, are here. You'd think there would be like a, like this a ticker past, or something. So this contract should be right up your alley. Use the ranger team's camera to take a photograph that includes at least two Draco Rex specimens. Nah, dude. I ain't got money for a Draco Rex, okay? Why don't you, like, give me a loan and then I can complete your stupid contract, okay? And even then, Draco Rex is only at 70% genome. That's some bullshit. 150,000 ain't actually that bad. Hey, I got it now. I could actually make one now. But I, mm, I ain't gonna do that. I ain't gonna do that. I want them to, to be more better. If I can make them all better, then I will do it. Dilophosaurus, extract that DNA. Yeah, extract the DNA all day. Hmm. We got Velociraptors. I really like those Dilophosaurus. I think that's the next thing that I want. Hmm. Dracorex would also be good. And it's cheaper. Go ahead. Go bring me some Dracorex DNA. Eight inches of solid bone on his head. He could break out of this cage at any time. Dangerous fella he is. Alright. Well, 
I suppose that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching, friends. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. I'm gonna take just a little break because, yeah, it's frustrating. It's like uh, one step forward, two steps back kind of shit, but we're making it slowly but surely. We're gonna get all of these islands unlocked, and then I could be like, all right, that's it. That was a good one. Big thanks to Frontier Entertainment for, for providing a key for this, this masterpiece. And it's still improving, you know? They're still adding dinosaurs and stuff to it, even after its release, which I think is really cool. Anyways, uh, aside from like, commenting, subscribing, you could also check out links in the description. We've got Twitter, we've got Discord, we've got Patreon, as well as uh, a fair few others. I'd like to give a big shout-out to MMX Akira and Nico the Legend for supporting us on Patreon currently. Massively appreciated. Those guys are just absolute heroes. Please join us for the next one, friends. Once again, this has been Jurassic World Evolution. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. And I shall see you then. And until then, friends. Bye-bye. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten.